So in this demo, I want to give you a feel for how you can use FSOFT Transact to scan to SharePoint Online. And the way this demo is going to go is that I've got uh, some HR documents that I want to scan and upload to SharePoint. And I want FSOFT to do a little bit of its magic. So we're actually going to classify the types of documents, the I-9s, the non-disclosure agreements as we process them. And then we're going to extract metadata. Now, this particular HR department also uses Microsoft Flow. So as the documents are uploaded, we're going to use that intelligent automation layer that FSOF provides to give Flow some information so they can automatically notify their legal department about I-9s that get uploaded. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. To, uh, to make this easy for end users, I created an FSOF page in SharePoint Online. And I've got a couple quick links on this page. For this particular demo, I'm actually going to use the Scan to SharePoint Online icon to launch the FSOFT web-based scanner. But uh, in another demo, uh, another video that I'll be doing, we'll also upload into a flow processing folder and use FSOFT APIs. But let's focus on today. So let's click on Scan to SharePoint Online. And like I said, that's going to launch uh, FSOF scanning interface. And this is all HTML5 web-based. Okay, you don't need a fat client. All you need is uh, one of the major browsers to go ahead and start the process. And I've got my trusty Epson DS530 here on my desktop. And I'm going to go ahead and click Start. Kick off the process. And I I've got a few documents in my stack. Now, one of the benefits of FSOFT is I don't have to scan documents individually. I can take the whole stack of documents I want to process, throw them in the feeder, and FSOFT will do all the heavy lifting for me. So contained within this bundle, you can see that I've scanned uh, nine pages. I've got a non-disclosure agreement. I've got a direct deposit enrollment form, and I've actually got an I-9 as well. Okay. So once again, all in one big bundle, and uh, I'm going to let FSOS split this, classify, and auto-extract data. So let's go ahead and click Finish. I'm all done with scanning. And what's going to happen here, it's going to go into the FSOF Capture Workflow. It's going to start processing documents. And like I said, the end goal here is to output it into my HR onboarding folder. And we'll go ahead and uh, custom name the file as well as extract uh, the last name and document type. Let's go ahead and hit the refresh button, see if uh, FSOF's done with its work. Still processing. Okay, you can see the documents are starting to come in. And there we go. So remember, I scanned that big old packet and I had FSOFT split it up. So you can see that I've got a direct deposit, an I-9, and an NDA for Mr. Bowles. I extracted the name and then I custom named the file and populated metadata fields. Now, in the background, I've actually got uh, one of my flows set up for I-9 notification with Microsoft Flow. So if I click into this, you'll see that when a file is created in that directory, we're actually going to parse the file name, and if it contains an I-9 value, we're going to go ahead and send an email. So I'm using that extracted data and that classified document type to go ahead and add intelligence and help automate HR processes even more. So the end result here is that I've got a, uh, an email that notifies uh, the legal or the immigration department that we've got a new I-9 form that they've got to go in and check out. So this is just a quick example of how you can scan the SharePoint online and add intelligence to workflows that exist within SharePoint. If you have any questions, go to fsoft.com and shoot us a note. Thanks.